1995, belongs to Mortal Kombat. Yes, the Mortal Kombat movie we exclusively reported on last series has opened in the States and is currently knocking seven shades of sushi out of the competition. All the characters from the game are there and it looks better than Pamela Anderson in a Celtic shirt. Scorpion and Sub-Zero. Deadliest of enemies. But slaves under my power. tells the story of three fighters, Liu Kang, Johnny Cage and fantastic looking lady Sonya Blade who are chosen by new age hippie bloke Raiden to travel to Outworld and take part in this slightly iffy Mortal Kombat tournament and of course unless they win it's pants for the rest of us back on Earth. So now you've seen what you'll be facing in the tournament. You mean Goro? And Shang Tsung. Will Shang Tsung fight in the tournament? If he chooses to. As a former champion he has the right to do so. And he's far more dangerous than Goro. His power comes from the souls of vanquished warriors. To fight Shang Tsung is to face not one, but a legion of adversaries. Which is nothing compared to a Celtic Rangers game. Filmed on location in Hollywood, Thailand and my toilet, the movie features over 200 special effects designed to make hard action movie ladies and gentle blokes look even harder. Considering the laughable Street Fighter movie of last year and the even greater fiasco of the Super Mario Brothers effort, we can only hope that when it opens next month, Mortal Kombat will prove that you can have a film based on a video game that isn't can. Go on, bloke, say something hard.